just kind of wandering, exploring through all of the geometry of the Shishibo, resulting in weird things accidentally. That's where I found that a second Shishibo came in handy, because I could make something new that I hadn't seen before, then I could take a second one and try and mimic all of the angles. So like I know that this angle right here is this, but I've got a star instead of my hive. So what if I open this up to be a little more hive-like? That's a sped up version of it. It always, it was not always that quick. Um, but it is a great way to start to teach yourself how it works. But like I was saying, if you have not seen one of these awesome cubes before, it's called Shishibo and it folds into a whole bunch of different shapes. I have found over a hundred, but I actually found something that I think might qualify as a brand new shape recently. And that is this weird thing right here. Does not really look like a shape at first. It's very weird uh, and it doesn't really hold its own. It's kind of closer to this thing right here. But if you move that off to the side just a little bit, um, then you get this weird and wacky shape. And if you connect four of them, I'll show you how in a minute, you can make this, which I think is just some really neat geometry.